10, 9, 8. We did it! We did it! Get it! Yes! <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome to Jurassic World the game. Where today, we did not unlock thousands of Why? Out of principle. No, not really. I just had a really busy weekend and I had no time, unfortunately. However, I did make sure to do a couple of battles uh, to get back up to Hunter League because I think I was in uh, Survivor and basically the prizes would have been better if I got um, Hunter and I was only a little bit off so I thought, ah, why not? But then the difference, I was on like 300 odd cups at Hunter League and in order to get to gold, I needed to double it. So basically I needed to do like 50 more battles which is, what, like 50, it's like 75 bucks worth and a lot of time, which I just couldn't be bothered. We've got a lot of things to do and I'm a busy man of, of recent, That that's definitely for sure. Uh, so we might as well open this, but it's like, don't worry, it's all doom and gloom because we've got, we're going to get something good because I am now going to open up the previous video I did and read the comments because... I asked what we should be leveling up, and I got a fair, a fair few decent ones, actually. Um, and I can't remember what they are off the top of my head now. Ha ha ha! <laughs> Beaver max up Secodontosaurus and Scapagonathus, uh, because they are getting a hybrid soon. And that has 11 upvotes. Um, also, hopefully James pins this. It's called Secodontonathus. It's a pterosaur, but it's weaker than Metrophodon. Well, most things are and Zalmonodon, and stronger than Terra, Terra Quetzal. Okay, so what is it? Uh, Secodontosaurus and Scapo. So, Seco, 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 Seco. Let's have a look. But which one? I feel like it's got to be a tournament. Ha ha! Okay! Oi! Look at that! We've actually got seven of the buggers. So, we can, yeah, we can definitely do this. Ha ha! Thank you! <laughs> this is why I read the comments. You keep me in touch with reality. Because I don't know. Lydia doesn't tell me nothing. <laughs> well, actually, they do. <laughs> to be fair, no, Lydia do actually t uh, send me some stuff. They tell me the events that are coming up and stuff like that. But uh, I don't get any uh, special treatment. Have I ever gotten any special treatment? Maybe apart from, like, the incubator. or Oh, no, that's Jurassic World Alive. No, I think they've given me bucks and stuff in this game before. Um, so with these lower level ones, I'm happy to spend 50 bucks. And that was really lucky on something that's, you know, it's not too expensive. Um, the level 10s. No, oh, you bugger you. <laughs> Whoopsies. Well, that's a level, level one I didn't want to do. Um, but actually, they're on the cheap. Probably forcing people to, once they've unlocked thal Thalasma, whatever it is, um, they can save some money on buying it. But uh, because that's a tournament creature, I'm just going to spend 250 uh, thingies on it just to get it maxed up. Because we'll get a level 20. I don't think I've had this guy ever maxed up to level 40. What was Pritrodon? Pritrodon wasn't Secodonosaurus, was it? It was like Dimetrodon, I think. It must have been... Was it actually Dimetrodon? I think it might have been. It might have been Dimetrodon. That's... For one of the best carnivore hybrids in the game, that's pretty cheap. Um, so we'll get this guy to level 20. So it's definitely going to be a creature that has more health than it does attack. And look at it go there. Yum, yum, yum. I think it's very purple. Purple and yellow, this guy. So we'll evolve, activate, 80. Ooh, ooh. I mean, we want to do Scapa. I feel like this is Scapa Ganathus. Haven't we maxed that thing up? I think we've already got that to level 40. I could be wrong. So we'll, we'll do an instant fuse with it just to save some bucks because now it's getting expensive. Um, so there you go at level 30. It has 2,552 attack and 429. Oh, help, 429 help. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I was like, no, remember which one's which. You have to do it before it goes. And at level four... Ah, have I never had this guy before? I mustn't have. I mustn't have. I've definitely faced it before. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Look at you. Let's get you to level 43,610 health and 607 attack. So just shy of like, or just more than a T-Rex has at level 40. And that's a regular. However, I don't think T-Rex has that much health. Yeah, Tux has about like 1,000 and odd, and this has got 3,000. So we may as well just collect this, collect that, and collect that. So it's another 200 bucks, which slightly reimburses us. Did you know that Secodontosaurus comes from Latin and Greek 
for cutting tooth lizard. Due to its long claws, paleontologist Robert Backer dubbed the Secodontosaurus a fox-faced finback. Right, so we need to find Robert Backer and interview him. Was it, I think he was in Lost World? Hold on, hold on. It was Robert Backer, Robert Backer. Yes, it was. Oh, that Robert Burke. Ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> Robert Backer's a different one. The second dinosaurus has slender jaws and consistent sized teeth specialized for catching fish and burrowing prey. Growing up to nine feet in length, an adult second dinosaurus can weigh over 250 pounds. Nine, like I'm, I'm six foot four or six foot three. So yeah, it's it's fairly sizable, especially if it's long. That's a that's a giant mouth. Yeah, you do, you wouldn't you wouldn't win against this thing. Oh, a code 19. Gotta get thingies. And that's I need to have a look at what super hybrids we still need to get because the super hybrids are always the best. So that's a level 40 ready to fuse. If that I mean it got 11 upvotes, so I'm assuming uh, we're gonna we're gonna get that. I just I, I just saw John Horner there. Oh sorry, Jack Horner. <laughs> I, I, I kind of love to interview I've already met Jack Horner before because um, when Frontier it was Frontier Expo that I brought my uh, Jurassic Park Explorer to and he was there, Jack Horner so I had a little chat on with him when it was in the green room um, I, saw, I was like I can't believe I'm actually, because this was before I went to interview um, what's it called uh, oh brilliant, thanks <laughs> Oh, no, what's it called? No, yeah, no, it's not Jack Horner. Oh my God, I can't remember his name. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> There's too many paleontologist names now. <laughs> ah, we'll do another one. Yeah, when it went in view, him anyway. <laughs> that was long before that. But now, I think Jack Horner's just solidified him as a very controversial figure in the world of dinosaurs and paleontology. So it'd be interesting just to bring up these, you know, the, the questions and just see what, you know, put, put it out there for anyone that wants to have their question given to him, which would be really interesting. Because we've done that in the past. We did that with um, Jim Kirkland. Ah, there it is. <laughs> with Jim Kirkland, we did that. I put out, you know, poll or... Uh, ask a question if you could to a paleontologist, what would it be? Um, I didn't want to specify what uh, or who it was, but um, you know, just, just for the sake of surprise. Uh, and we did that with Nigel Marvin as well. And I think most people had the same words like, how did you not die in the dingy dingy? <laughs> uh, right, we don't need to worry about that. We'll collect, oh, we'll collect some of those. We'll collect that as well. We'll collect these, oh yes. Um, right, what was I doing? It was the Secodonosaurus and the Scapa. So Scapa is definitely a flyer. I feel like I've had it level 40. Yeah, it's already level 40. And I have loads more. Good God. Do I, I don't, I think we can just sell these. At 1,000 and odd a pop. I mean, we'll keep, we'll keep those guys. Because, you know, we fed those ones. Right, just make sure I don't accidentally sell the level 40. Which was that one. Ooh, that's a lot of DNA. Thank you, Scappers. Uh, was there any other things that I was told to level up? We are able to get this, the Pelicathilius. Right, so heck yeah. I mean, finally I got this thing leveled up to level 40, but if I can... Ooh, ooh. Do you think it's going to be expensive on the books, or do you think it's not? It still leaves us with four instant fuses. Um... I feel like it's not, right? It's not! It's not gonna be expensive. I don't think so. It's 80 bucks. Oh dear. <laughs> oh no! All the bucks I'm losing! Oh damn it. You know, I should've just done it. I should've just done it. Because I know if I run out of instant fuses, I'll not fuse anything else. I'll just be like, ah, oh, that'll do. Oh, what is going on with its frill? It's like part of its neck. Beautiful, but well, it's over there. Sweet! Let's have a look at him. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. look at you! Let's feed you 1,331 health and 416 attack. So that will have half the price now of getting another one. So instead of 1,000 uh, two pentactylus DNA, it should only be 500. So the wings of this super hybrid pterosaur may be slightly shorter than those of its forebearers, but are twice as strong. Oh, a 10! Monolock, look at that. Fair enough, a rare giving me 10 super DNA. Heck yeah. This is all going towards it, you see. 
<laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. I can count. Heck yeah. Baby's first dinosaur game. What? <laughs> oh, were you kidding me? Just one, two, back. And then I'm worn up now. I hate that. I, I, I honestly, I clicked on it. I don't know where it registered my fingerprint. Do I not have fingerprints? Are they all worn off? They might be worn off for, from years of playing video games, possibly. Well, as long as we get over 100 DNA. Or not, you know, whatevs. Is what it is, I suppose. I might have been able to do it, but 90 DNA will do it. 10, 10 of that. Oh, an 8. Heck yeah, the proto Stager thing this is. It's an, oh God, it's a hard one. Why? It was only eight. Oh, the other one was way harder. Oh, come on. You're going to do this time. Hey, hey, hey. And this one? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Well, that was lucky. Ooh, they got nature's corn dogs in the side there. Hot dogs. I guess you'd say corn dog, wouldn't you? Because it's on a stick. You Americans. Everything with hot dogs and sugar and all the sauces. It's weird. <laughs> we like sweet. We like savory. Put them together. We don't have time to have separate dishes. Are you kidding me? Oh, we did it all there. Sweet. Whoa, 600 DNA from that. Nice. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Right. Okay. So, uh, also, we got the lottery as well. Um, oh, it's reset as well. Okay, so did we get a pack? We didn't get a pack. I did this not too long ago and I got a pack, but of course I'm recording a video. Don't get a pack. Ah, this is the way the cookie crumbles. And I'm not doing it for that. That's really not worth it. Okay, so now we've got the level 10 Tupendactylus, and we can get another one for 50 or 500. So what is a level 40? Let's have a look. 2,765 health and 864 attack. For what? 160 extra super DNA. You get better health. You get way better attack. A Montosaurus is new. We've never had a Montosaurus. Heck yeah. Let's spend 250 making it a Montosaurus in the park. Was this? Yeah, this must be a tournament. I'd, it looks very similar to a Jurassic World one. Oh, we're getting all the new. To look at you. You're so cute. Right, let's feed you. Level 10, because no doubt we'll need you eventually. It's got weird little fingers and dummies. So 522 health and 339 attack. Actually, ooh, that's pretty decent. There's not a big difference between health and attack, which means that it's probably quite balanced and probably more in the favor of uh, of attack than it is health. But look at the tail. This is 100% Jurassic World Evolution, man. Uh, all the games now are just like, mm, Jurassic World Evolution had really good renders and dinosaurs. Can we just use those? <laughs> I mean, obviously, they made that. So, had two legendaries, another 50. 50, yes. Um, right, so what's coming? Do we have anything else coming up? And, uh, probably not. We have the North America pack. We've got the food pack. Uh, right, now, I've got something here. It's saying that I could have more. Right, but it still doesn't tell me how much DNA I have of this. Like, th this is the only way I can see it. So the most I've got is 6,000 Dimetrodon DNA. And in fact, we'll get some more in a second. Here we go. Whoa, -ho -ho! there we go. Even more. So what do, what is Dimetrodon DNA? It's not Tupendactylus. It's got to be this, the Dimetrocarnus, right? And we, how much does it cost? Only 800. We got 6,000 of this DNA. What? Oh, and it's good. It's good. And it's only 200 a pop for this one, actually, for instant speed up. Heck yeah, instant. Yes. Yes. Oh, we can get it. Well, if I, you know, I buy one, it's only 22 hours. I saved 80 bucks. Brilliant. Sweet. It's not really that. And you know what? We're going to get this guy maxed up. This guy's really freaking good. This is what I want these episodes to be because I have so many resources now. And it's like, well, I don't want every episode to just be, you know, the same thing. We can level up so many different dinosaurs. Who doesn't? That's what you came here for. You want to see the max level of everything dinosaur. Except for Thalasmus Murris, because nobody cares about that one. I still want to do an updated version, a video of like top 10 dinosaurs. I feel like it needs to be top 20. Really? Because we've got so many. What about top 11? Top 15. Well, look at that. Thank you, Eupocephalus, for 35 DNA. But the five of that, you know what? I think we we need to switch the um, the code 19 DNA. 
Right, so what do we have here? We don't need two pendaclas. I don't care about that. I feel like we don't want the Sarko because that DNA is rubbish. Indoraptor's always good. Indoraptor's always good. We should always get that if we can. Um, right, what else is the best? The best! So we've got a lot of rares. We've got Indoraptors, which are the only legendary super rares. And then the other ones is Spinatosuchus and Gigacephalus or Gigancacephalus. We should just fill them all up, man, shouldn't we? That's what we should do. Um, right, so where where did that guy go? Was he here? I think he was on the other side, wasn't he? He was, he was over here somewhere. Have I lost him? I think I might have lost him. <laughs> Whoops. Let's go into here. Click on you. Go to. Don't know where you were, but we can get a level 30. We got so much food, man. So much. We haven't even done the trades to see what we can get. Right, so evolve instant fuse. Or should we... It's like 80, isn't it, to fuse? I, oh, we actually, we don't even know what it is, I don't think. Ah, sod it. May as well. May as well. May as well use them. We'll get them all back in a week's time. Uh, so we'll evolve you. Instant fuse. We've got eight of them. If I can save books, I'll save books. Right, sweet. So we got a level 20 of that. 3,434 health and 1,221 attack. Isn't this a toy? Did Hasbro do it? Oh, I think it was Mattel. I think Mattel did a Dimetrodon toy, but it had the same colorings as this thing. Oh, it looks so cool, though. I like it. Right, boom. Instant fuse. There we go. Sweet. I think we can get this to level 40, man. I think we can get this to level 40. So here it is. A level 30. 4,257 health and 1,660 attack. Yeah, look at that. That looks gorgeous. A level 40. Ooh, we need... I don't think I've ever seen this at level 40. Ooh, surprise. Right, so we need another four of them, which is going to cost us... It's like 280 d uh, bucks each to buy. So 280 for 560. So it's 1,120 bucks-ish, which is fine. And then it's going to cost us a little bit extra bucks. Uh, so we'll just collect those and get 34 books. Hey, the bright blues and reds of this creature's skins grow or skin grow more distinct as the creature matures. While shaped like the Metrodon, this super hybrid is as vicious and cunning as Carnoraptor. As its name suggests, Dimetricarnus is a carnivorous creature. <laughs> well, and thanks, Lydia, for clearing that one up. <laughs> Let me just make sure that we are, we're still recording all okay. Yes. Yes, we are. Brilliant. Right. So, we need to buy more of these guys. Uh, actually, we only have 850. So, that's 1,700 DNA. And how much do we have? I forget how long I've been playing this game for. Honestly. Right. Uh, where are you? There you are. Go to. Boom. And buy. And uh, just buy. Just buy. These are, th like, this is the thing, right? And this is how they get you. Because they want you to inst- Like, for me, anyway, I feel like Lugia wants me- Or Jam City, I should say. Want me to level up the tournament creatures right away. And that costs a lot of books. However, the tournament creatures are not as good as these things. And I'm kind of happy. I hope I hope I haven't made them wise to this. Because I want to keep it this way. <laughs> Right, so we got two instant fuses. Um, what we'll do is we'll instant fuse the level 30, and then we'll instant fuse the level 40. So we are going to have to take a little bit of a hit here um, on a couple of books. But again, we haven't done the trades. So the trades might be... <laughs> maybe. Might be where we can actually do some good and get some back. Uh, so activate this. And then that'll... So it's only 80 bucks for this. So it's not so bad. And every day we get a pack, which at least guarantees us 55 bucks. So it's just setting us back a couple of days. And that's... If we get some good trades in the trade harbor, sorted. That's like a couple of hundred de uh, bucks right there. And luckily, Ludia... It's been in the game long enough that Ludia haven't fixed it. And they're like... So, to me, they went... Ah, whatever. It's fine. Oh, wait, no. I should have instantly infused this. Ah, never mind. <laughs> just watch the books go down. 120 and 80. Let's go. Boom! Collect! Done and done! Get that to level 30. Yeah, we don't need to worry about food. Instant fuse. 280 DNA. Oh, yes. Here we go. Dimetricarnus. Oh, that's a that's a fancy little frill. Although, I kind of expected a bit more. It just seems a little bit more jagged. So, whoa! 5,075 of the 1,995 attack. 
I wonder where that puts it. It's 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 not in the top 10, I don't think, but it's still pretty high. Look at it. Look at it. It looks gorgeous. Let's see its animations. Oh, it's got the strokey head. Yum yum. And then will it will it do the roll? Does, does the Metrodon do the roll? Does it roll its back? No, it doesn't. Okay. I feel like, oh, that's cool. As soon as it rolls over or we get a little bit of a bite. Right, so how many books? 68 books, sweet. Uh, like the Demetron, it is believed Demetrocarnus' sale helps in both mating displays and heat regulation. This is your hybrid! What do you mean is believed? You should know! <laughs> Fair enough, whatevs. Right, okay, so Demetrocarnus, where do you stack up in the battles? That's what I'm kind of interested. We got, here we go, Battle Stage Infinite, we've got to do. So, you're not there. Yeah. Although, I feel like we're not far- There it is! So it's just below Monostega, uh, Monostegatops. Even though it has more attack, but it has a, like a thousand less health, so... Eh, but still, a level 10! Level 10! <laughs> level friggin' 10! So it's like, what, a thousand or two thousand super DNA to get an Indoraptor, right? But, to get level 40 to Metricanus, it's like three thousand. So, actually... You might as well, you're better just having everything set to raptor DNA and just getting Indoraptors than Demetricarnus. Like, you, you've spent 3,000 DNA, or super DNA, to get one level 40. And it's not even, I mean, it's got the same amount of health as level 10 Indoraptor, but not, nowhere near the same attack. And if you were to just do Indoraptor, you'd have three Indoraptors. All better than Demetricarnus. And three different ones, so you could use it for three different battles. So, yeah, yeah, it is what it is. Uh, we don't have any more instant fuses, but that's another level 40 done. Um, the next one that's closest, I guess, is the Tapajalafa left. <laughs> the Tapa Jelly Pot. Um, so I don't know how good the Oh, this one's pretty decent too, actually. Um, you know what? I'm gonna put them all in. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna buy them because I I could do, but we'll save that for another video. What I will do, however is we need four of these. So, can we buy four of them? How much uh, eupocephalus DNA do we have? Right, we can't. We could get two, though. So we may as well get two. Uh, activate for ten bucks, heck yeah. Um, and then, what else do I have? Monolophosaurus and Caprosuchus. Ankylosaur is also 2,000 and odd. But I don't know what takes Ankylosaur. Spy that must be the Capra, right? We've got loads of this. We've got loads of the Capra, so I do not mind doing that one at all. Because I think... I mean, it's a super rare, right? It it's probably going to be good. So there we go. We've, we've spent all our bucks, and really, we only have to wait three days for them all to clear out. And only 24 hours for... So we could really speed through. We could do a video, like, every day on the super hybrids if we wanted to. We'd have to wait a week to get free fuses. <laughs> You know, it is what it is. Uh, right, have we got anything good here? Uh, any books? Ooh. Ah, it's not worth it. It's tempting, but 64 VIP points really isn't worth it. But we'll do decorations, and we'll just sell a John Hammonds for, like, 900 VIP, po VIP points, basically. And then we get VIP dinosaurs, and VIP dinosaurs are so good. And they're super quick. Uh, heck yeah. So we're on, like... 6,000 books, weren't we? Oh my god, yes! More, please! Yes! Oh, this is good, this is good. That was really good. Um, that was lucky. If only that one. That would have been 300 books. Next one. <gasps> yes! Another hundo! And this one? 73? Oh my god, we're getting so lucky! If I saved up 10,000 VIP points, right? And I bought a pack. And I got a VIP creature. I can sell a VIP creature for 5,000 bucks. So technically, if I was just wanting to trade that, it's not worth it. Yeah, we'll skip it. We'll skip that one. And this is the final one, and we have some good books. Is it a good one? Ooh, you know what? Yep, yeah, we'll take that. Oh, we're almost on to 5,000. And another one. Oh, there it is! 300! Wow! Yes! That's what's good about the, the, the harbor. It's awesome. You get some good trades in here. Save yourself weeks of gathering, like, what precious little crumbs of books you can get here and there throughout the entire game. Um, ooh, I'm gonna collect from the DNA building there. Right, there was something else I was gonna do. Yes, so we need to purchase prize drops, Fuser Reef, 
pet dinosaurs, apparently. Right, who's got the most that I haven't sold? Uh, yeah, one, two, three, four. We've got a lot of pterodactylises we could sell as well. Um, wow, I've only got like one of each dinosaur these days. That was the goal when this game first started, to get level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10 of every dinosaur. Ha-ha! <laughs> Tappy Jar, you're going to get me 18 boss DNA. Thank you, buddy. Yes. Boom. I think it's boss DNA, but there you go. We're almost on 6,000 for that. And we can still level this guy up to level 60 if we wished. Because then we unlock... Oh, we got the final power move. But what's... Who's got the best? I still think it's Salamander. They haven't made it where it's 100% defensive anymore. Oh, heck yeah. Hold on. Do you have your own? Oh, you don't go any higher. Damn. Right, evolutions. It's 200 to get to level 31. Oh, we have to. If we level this thing up... Wait, two more levels, I think. Which is only 1,000. We get 200 bucks. So one, two... Oh, okay. Well, we got another badge, but okay. So we need level. We need level three. Okay, one more. There we go. Two hundred bucks. Now, do you have better moves? Uh, unlocks at prestige rank one. Oh, you need to be level fifty or forty for that, I think. But you know what? I'll take the two hundred bucks. If you manage to dodge the horns, you might still find yourself trampled beneath its powerful feet. Right now, you guys, you're level one, so. I mean, you should be pretty cheap, right, Salamander? Yeah, let's get Salamander off. Heck yeah. Might as well. If we get to level 10 or level 11, that's a hundred bucks. Heck yeah. And, uh, should we, should we get it higher? I feel like we should. And level 21, yep, another hundred bucks. Heck yeah. So the ridges of Salamander 16's back are extremely sharp, but surprisingly flexible, allowing them to slip between the cracks of an opponent's armor. I'm assuming... Spike it? I don't know. And what's the other one? Ooh. We are two levels away from getting, two, like, 200 bucks here. So we may as well. Another badge complete. Oh, it's 100 bucks. Okay, wow. Okay, did we start on 6,000? I feel like we started on 6,000. We've done really well here. In getting all these books back. Valkyrie 77 sharp edge wings let it cut through aerial opposition with ease. They just love it's just like uh, a buzz buzz word or something. It's like a phrase. It's like um you'd find on a trailer. Right, so everything's like <laughs> 31, 21, 21. Uh we got a 50, because I don't think we get anything extra for leveling this guy up, and I don't think we can. We can? What? Why is it so cheap? I thought it was going to be way higher to make it a higher level. Um, oh, there you go. That's better. There it is. So we got level 52. 9,000 health. If only I could use that in my regular battles. Right, so we got a battle stage infinite to do here. So, I don't think we can speed up. Yeah, we got no VIPs left for that because that's done. Um, have we got any instant hatches? I think we've... Have we let... Is everything used up? Yep, yeah, everything's used up. The instant fuse. We've got one instant fuse left. So I think we had a special mission for a reef. Yeah, so we can fuse a reef. Well, let's dive into the water. Uh, we've got an Archelon to fuse. No, we don't, because that was used for a hybrid. Uh, you're basically maxed out. Mate, yeah, get you to level 40. There you go, buddy. The Dolly Rantiops. Who's, who looks like it was eating an invisible, uh, <laughs> invisible fish there, but all right. Yum, yum. You're level 40. Nice one. Uh, now, what else do we have that's a reef that could be used for... Uh, Horphosaurus? Nope. Ah, Hanodus? No. Uh, you, we need to buy one, but, so we can't. Haven't got any of those. Haven't got any of those. Yeah, there we go. Instant fuse. A light pleuridon. Why not? There you go. Boom. And another 18 boss DNA. Sweet. Right, so we've got to fuse three aquatics for 150. Oh, there's got to be something we could do for cheap. There's got to be some really cheap ones. I mean, there's only rares. Uh, nope, you're not a rare. Or super rare, sorry. Uh, Prognathodon, no. I think I've sold everything here. Oh, 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 I forgot about you. Heck yeah. Uh, let's do this, the Ophthalmosaur. 
So 70 and four. Oh, God. Is it worth it? We just need one more fuse. Oh, it's gonna be. I would trade 100 bucks for 150 boss DNA. Heck yeah. So we'll get this to... We'll get another one to level 20. Uh, 70 bucks and do it first time. Uh, yeah! Okay, that's 94 bucks. No! No! All my hard work! Oh my... Wow, how dare you? Thanks, game. Thank you. There we go. That Was it worth it? No. <laughs> But it's done. 150. There you go. <laughs> right. Anyway, back to what we were going to do, which is the mystery pack, because we could get books in here. So this is a pretty dirty and nasty team. Um, really, if we used all amphibians, we'd be good. But I don't think we have any good amphibians ever. Um, the best one we've got is Gorgosuchus. Which dies in two hits to Gripo. But apart from that, it's actually all right. So I'm thinking we put Gorgosuchus in. He'll swap to his Gripo. Then we could probably kill a Metrophodon. Um, if once Gorgosuchus dies. And then we need something good. So... If I put in Scorpius Rex. Scorpius Rex could die to two hits from Indoraptor Gen 2. But I don't think Udon would. And it's only got 300 less attack. It'll be close. But I don't think it'll be able to do, you know, like, what, 700? And yeah, I don't think it's going to do 1,700 extra attack with two hits. I don't think so. So big brain play. Here we go. Can we do it? Is it possible? I will go for the reserve, because we don't die in two hits. Which is really good. Why do we not have any good amphibians? I need to have a look. There's surely going to be some good amphibians I'm not using. Right, I don't care if Gorgosuch just dies. I just want to have as many reserves for um, Metrof Metrophodon when it comes in. Because it'll do like 8,000 attack. Oh, yeah. It's definitely going to kill it in two hits. But now he has to go for four attack to kill me. Minimum. So he has to, like, expend all his energy here if he wants to kill me. Oh, yes! That's a, well, th that's a free common pack. Sweet! Hopefully we get some bucks from it. So two hits kills it. And then we'll go for all of that. I'm pretty sure two hits kills it. I The math works out, yes. And Enosaurus comes in, and I don't even care. Go for four attack. Do it! Oh, or not! Whatever's... Um, we could probably, uh, switch to Udon, and, yeah, switching to Udon's probably better. One, two, three, kills it, factor in two, just in case. Oh, it's perfect! Bam! And finally, the crazy Interruptor comes in, and I think it has to go for three attack. I think. So, if it does, it'll go for five. If it doesn't, it'll go for four. <laughs> just so good. <laughs> And Metrophodon! Yay! Alright, go for it! We need 20 of these buggers! If only there was this in the movie. If they put Demet 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 Demetrophodon. Metrophodon in, that'd be awesome. And a hundred! I just want all the hybrids. Yes! Oh, and a hundred, a hundred bucks. Oh, that game was so generous. Thank you. And a Guan Long. As well as... 130 uh, super DNA points. Oh, the next one's a le- Oh, sweet. <gasps> we could have 300 bucks in this. Oh my god. If we sped it up, won it, and got 300 bucks, I'd be up 12 D- 12 bucks. <laughs> there's really not- there's really no point in it. Uh, I only- the, honestly, the only reason I do, like, packs or events is if it has bucks in it. I don't really care for DNA. I've got plenty of dinosaurs if I wanted to sell them. And um, either some more. I think we've got, yeah, aquatic creatures. We could enter that, get another 60 bucks. And again, once we do this, that's another guaranteed 55 bucks. And yeah, wow, we've done so much. We've leveled up so many creatures. I got level 40. Super high. I kind of want to use it. Hold on, hold on. Let's do it in a boosted battle. Heck yeah. So we'll put in, we'll put in it first. Where is it? There is Demetricanus. And then we'll put in two really weak creatures. We'll make sure... What, ooh, what's Terrify? Uh, reduce attack stat of entire opposing team by 45%. Heck yeah. And then we'll put in... 
Do we, if we boost his attack by 10%, that's 199. However, what's the other one? So you've got this, the alpha, which is, oh yeah, so we got to do the 10%. Which is rally. Yeah, that makes more sense. Although, otherwise, if we did it increase by 15% for its health, it would get like over 500 extra health. So it's either a thousand and odd extra health or 400 attack. And I think 400 attack's the way forward. Let's go. Let's see if we can completely sweep that team. Hopefully it equals out. I'm hoping. Otherwise we're screwed. Please don't. Oh! Why an Indoraptor? Why? Gen 2. Only stab. Oh, well, it's going to up its own attack to 45, but we terrify everything. So bye-bye. Yes. Oh, God, we need that. Oh, boy, do we need that. Ooh. 180 odd. And the next one. Oh, oh. <laughs> Dude, what the I think I can kill it in three hits. I think I can. I might have needed the health, though. As long as I kill this thing, I'm Gucci. But, oh, God. Oh, that's a big hit. I don't like that. Right, I'm going to go for one block. Because, actually, I'm go I'll go for two reserves. Sod it. I can survive two hits. I can survive two hits. Although, I may need to switch out to Guan Long at some point And just follow it off. Please don't attack me for two. I, I mean, you can attack me for two, but please don't. Don't attack me for two. Ah, that's kind of awkward. One's like... Argh. Okay, so we're on four. Um... Right, so I'm, I'm going to switch out Guan Long. I'm so sorry to do this to you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> a lamb to the slaughter. Oh, okay, it's not so bad. I kind of wish that it had have gone for a reserve, because then it would have guaranteed a kill and went for four. Because then I would have only had... Oh, it's got one block. It's got one block. Okay. Right, so we do have 2,200. Our attack's a little bit down. Uh, it's got one block. And the next one is just 243 attacks. So one, two, three kills it. Factor in one, and then I might as well just go for one block and one reserve just in case, because it, it didn't go for it. So Dramatricana's kill, and that's it. From 1,400 attack to 243. Oh, it didn't have anything. It did go for a full on attack. Oh, I'm an idiot. My bad. <laughs> I shouldn't have even factored in one. I could have done this way better. Right, and now we can just go all out here. Let's go for a five. Bam! Let's see the five animation. Because that 243 attack gets turned into eight attack. <laughs> oh no! It's gonna wound me. Just did a thousand damage! That's way more than it could have ever have done. Oh damn! That's kind of genius, in a way. If you just put wound on like throwaway dinosaurs. You could just, like, swap it in and BAM! Thousand damage off. More than a Guanlun could ever hope to. But then it is taking up a slot. And they were just support creatures for Dometricarnus. I so feel like there was a Dometrodon. I'm gonna- I'm gonna try and find that toy. It was a Dometrodon toy that looked like that. 100%. We just won a Spinoraptor, guys. That was really good! What?! <laughs> we just won a- Hold up! Hold up! Spinoraptor! Quackers! I, I didn't even have- Oh, I got one quack. How much do you sell for? So that was 9,000 DNA worth I just won. Oh, oh, that was very good. Either very lucky or I'm missing out on a trick here and I should be doing those battles. Well, anyway, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. Another 40-odd minute video, but it was loads of fun. Did so much. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Bye-bye. <laughs>